As developers, we hate false positives. And having too many false positives is probably the biggest reason for not adopting static analysis into your workflow. With all this noise, it's easy to miss critical issues in your code base. But static analysis doesn't have to be so noisy. At DeepSource, we ensure a false positive rate of less than 5%, which means out of the 100 issues we flag, 95 are guaranteed to be accurate. But for those instances when you come across a false positive, we've made it easy for you to report it directly from the DeepSource dashboard. Let me guide you through it with an example. In this case, DeepSource has flagged Windows Error as an undefined name. Windows Error has been deprecated and merged into OS Error since the release of Python 3.3. But if your project is using Python 3.1, Windows Error is a built-in exception, and that makes this issue a false positive. To report this issue, click on this symbol at the top right of the occurrence and select This is a false positive. You may choose to give us more information as to why this occurrence is a false positive. This will help our language team in judging the validity and making the changes to our analyzer to resolve the false positive. Click on Confirm and Ignore, and the false positive issue would be removed from your dashboard, leaving just the ones you should care about. It's that simple. I hope this video helps you make the best out of DeepSource. If you want to know more, check out our documentation at deepsource.io docs.